In Ship Constructor 2012 R2, the ability to define cable supports and use them in modeling and production output has been introduced. Cable supports are defined in Manager by entering applicable attributes for each support. Notice that an optional attribute is Insertion Period. The insertion period defines the default distance at which a cable support can be automatically repeated along the length of a space allocation. Once the cable support library has been set up and an appropriate naming convention defined, users may begin to utilize cable supports within space allocations. Utilizing space allocations results in several practical advantages. The first is that cable supports can be automatically inserted along the length of a space allocation. The second is that interference checks between and around cable supports can be performed because the space allocation is lofted between the supports. And the third is that these supports will also fully integrate with Ship Constructor's upcoming cable routing and management functionality. In Ship Constructor 2012R2, Commands have been introduced to quickly array cable supports along a space allocation. The user need not worry about naming the cable supports during insertion, as commands have also been created which allow a naming strategy to be applied along the space allocation, in selection order or via coordinate direction. As with all ship constructor models, Associative production drawings can be created very easily and be updated as the model changes throughout the life cycle of a project. In practical terms, cable supports in combination with space allocations creates new and efficient avenues to route and construct wireways throughout a project. More information about cable supports can be found on our website at www.shipconstructor.com.